Greetings, my fellow wet shavers. Uh, Tony Saponi here. Um, I have a brand new YouTube channel dedicated to shaving and product reviews. I'm very excited about it. I call it Tony Saponi's Sunday Shave. Um, my philosophy in terms of shaving is very simple. You have to shave every day. Why make it a chore? It's that simple. Enjoy it. Enjoy yourself. Um, it's very relaxing. You know, you come home at the end of a long day, you have that nice relaxing shave. Um, Shaving is my yoga, it's my zen, it's my meditation. Uh, it, you know, it, it's just a good way to relax for towards the end of the day. There's so many different types of creams and soaps and razors and razor blades and a host of other products uh, pretty much aimed at making your shaving enjoyable. Um, we're going to explore some of these together. Um, without further ado, what I would like to do is get into my first shave. I'd like to welcome you all to the channel. If you like what you see, please subscribe. Help me spread the love, like the video, um, you know, and get as many people as you can to subscribe. Um, you know, the better this works out, the more I'll be able to, you know, create new videos and give you my opinions of different products and all. Now, again, having said that, these are my opinions. Um, everybody has an opinion about various things. Uh, I'm going to give you mine how they react. Everybody's face is different. Everybody's face responds to different things differently. Um, that's nothing more than you would expect. That's why there are so many different types of products out there to accommodate a wide variety of faces, a wide variety of beards um, that react to those products differently. Uh, there are some soaps that I don't necessarily like. Um, there are other soaps that I see some other videos on that really get rave reviews and I try them and not so much. Um, but anyway, like I said, I'm going to give you my, my unbiased opinion of these things. I do not sell products. I do not work for anybody that sells products. I get no kickback or anything like that. Um, pretty much all the products that I review will be products that I use, products that I buy, uh, samples that I may buy from companies. Um, you know, sometimes you get these little, uh, these, these small little amounts of shaving cream or whatever, good for a shave or two. Um, those are really good because what you can do is you can try them, see how you like them before you go and spend, you know, a significant amount of uh, cash to, you know, go ahead and get this gigantic jar and then you end up not liking it. Um, Additionally, razors come the same way. Um, you know, rather than going out and buying a hundred pack of a certain blade, and then you make a, you know, you you try it and you don't like the way that blade reacts with your face. Um, okay, now you got 99 blades you have nothing to do with. Um, so, you know, a lot of these companies will have, you know, you get these small little boxes that have five blades, ten blades, whatever. It's a very small outlay of cash, and you can get. Uh, you can get to know the razor. You make a determination if you like it, if it's for you. Um, today what we're going to do is, I'm going to start it off very safe. I'm going to use my go-to stuff. Uh, I'm going to be shaving with my Edward Jagger um, razor, Edwin Jagger. Um, this one had gotten some, some, some interesting feedback. Um, the handles on these things had a tendency of splitting. Personally, I don't have too much of a problem with this. Uh, to me, it gives it more of a of an old razor kind of a vibe. Um, and this is the one that has the uh, the, the the faux ivory handle. Um, I'm going to be using these uh, Persona double edge uh, stainless steel blades. I love these things. I absolutely love the shave that you get out of them. Um, I'm going to be using my uh, Razorock ply soft brush with the Italian flag, of course. Um, and for the shaving cream, we're going to be using the Martin De Condre. Um To me, this is just the most incredible soap. Um, this is the original scent. It's very light. It's very fresh. Um, I like it. The soap itself lathers immediately. It's, it's insane. It really is. And you barely use any of it. Um, this is quite expensive. Um, you know, a lot of there's a lot of talk on the internet on whether or not this is worth it. Um, I believe it is. I truly believe it is. Um, the amount that you use is so minimal. I see some guys loading these things up and loading these things up. It's like ten minutes later, you fast forward, they're still loading it up. Um, you, my experience is you don't need to do that with this soap. It's one of the few. Now I do load some soaps up. Um, 
not so much of this. Um, what I'm going to do here for starters, I'm going to get the face wet. Got to start with a wet mug. Okay. I'm not going to bowl lather today. Um, what I do, I hold this upside down. And I believe we are good. That is really about all you need. Sprinkle a little bit of water on top of the brush. I like to soak up with a relatively, not a dry brush, but a damp brush. I, I don't like too much water on it because then it gets all soapy and foamy and it becomes a mess. I got some nice warm water I'm going to face lather. You can always add water. You can't take it away. It's a little stiff. Love the smell of this. Very light, very clean. And the lather is amazing. Nice sharp persona blade, you can feel it just effortlessly cutting through the whiskers. Very light pressure, that's all you need. Try to keep my skin as tight as possible. Once in a while, I get the urge to take my straight razor out and I have very questionable skills of the straight razor. Very questionable skills. I'm actually healing up pretty nicely. Okay, second pass. Second and third passes. I don't really put anything on super thick or anything like that. I just kind of cover it because most of the bulky hair is gone. And with this Martin de Condre, it's uh, an amazing soap. It gives me a lot of a lot of cushion and a lot of glide. All right, this uh, this pass we're gonna go crossways. I like the persona blades. Um, they're not as sharp as the feathers. Not nearly as sharp as the feathers. I don't know anything that's as sharp as the feathers. Those things are very sharp. Um, a feather in this razor isn't too bad because this is uh, what I would consider a very mild. A little weeper on my lip had that happen. Because I was yakking and blabbing. 
And speaking of which, these videos are all gonna be... There's no editing here, so if I cut my juggler open, you're gonna see it on live TV. Or on YouTube TV, anyway. And uh, my hot water is like insanely hot. So I'm gonna do a quick rinse. This was from my uh, straight razor. I started up a little too high. That's already really smooth just from those two passes. Third pass, I'm pretty much going to use as a cleanup. I'm going to take it out of the brush, put it on. And uh, from there, I can feel around if there's any spots that I missed. We're good here, we're good here. My trouble spots are right under here where the hair is like crazy thick. Alright, you got it. And a little back here. Alright, do the rinser off. That is very, that's exactly what I want. It's nice and smooth, got it all over the place. And it took a little off my lip. Um, okay, so today we, uh, we used that Edwin Jagger um, Persona Blade, Plyosoft Synthetic Brush. I will use these things all day long. Personally, I think these things, I love them. Absolutely love them. I like them better. I've had badgers, I've had boars. I love these, absolutely love these things. Um, Martin DeCondre, to me, well worth the price. Well worth the price. If you can find a, uh, a sample, I would urge you to get it. Try it for yourself. Um, it lathers immediately. It lathers very thick. It's very cushiony. Um, it just really makes the shave very nice. It's a scent that uh, it's a scent that you'll find quite enjoyable. All right. I wanted to thank you guys for the. Uh, for watching this video. Like I said, if you like the channel, subscribe to it. Um, if you like this video, like it, help me spread the love, and we'll be able to review more and more projects as time goes on. We'll see you soon.